protected. A group of concerned citizens is getting a close-up tour in the Puntledge Forest today and a look at what can be saved if the community raises a further $150,000. It's very important to me because I am very interested in the environment and I, I really am really quite concerned about the future and where the forests are and where our wildlife and fisheries are going. The land at risk is along the Puntledge River between the Comox Lake Dam and Barber's Hole, a 37 hectare piece nestled among another 61 hectares already saved. And now we're here uh, with BC, BC Hydro owning the land and uh, Manulife owning the timber rights and we're trying to buy that final 37 hectares of timber rights so we can protect it forever. The area known as Bevan Trails was last logged in 1902 then became a bustling town site home to a thousand people when coal was being mined nearby. The area has been reforesting naturally since then which makes it even more valuable. It's uh, uh, biodiverse because it wasn't tree planted in the 20s or at any point it came back the way it was before it was logged so there's big leaf maple douglas fir western red cedar uh, sitka spruce uh, all the stuff that wouldn't have been planted if it was a tree farm the comox valley land trust started efforts to save this forest after manulife announced its intentions to start logging it back in 2020 now the finish line is in sight and future generations here could have an old growth forest in their own backyard it's a maturing forest, so it's on its way to becoming old growth. So this would be my grandchildren's old growth forest. And the trees are already helping in the fight against climate change. Well, you know, we've talked about it for its recreational values and its ecological values. Um, it's also really important for climate, the climate change. I mean, these trees are obviously at their full potential now to sequester carbon once a tree gets to be around 100 years old. If $150,000 is raised, it will be tripled by private sponsors to meet the actual goal of $450,000. The deadline is March 2025.